Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here coming at you again with another video and we are over on the new playthrough that we are, we YouTubers are doing and uh, yeah, it's having some fun. So in this episode, I found Terrifier's base. I don't know if he's in it, but we're going to go ahead and try and play knock knock with him. And I've also got some stuff to tame a couple of griffins, should I get lucky enough. But uh, we'll see how that actually works out. So Terrifier's base was just over this hill. I'm actually going to be doing him a service because there was actually quite a few dangerous tames nearby. So I'm going to pull them all away first off. Um, like he had some aloes around. There they are up there. I'll pull them. Mm, yeah, those are probably far enough away for him. But there was some other stuff here like saber tooths. Yes, that I don't want him running out that front door and, you know, getting destroyed by. There we go. Let's pull them all off this cliff over here. There we go. You're welcome, buddy. Um, maybe they are afraid, apparently. Apparently they've decided they're afraid, so that's interesting. I thought they weren't afraid of stuff like this, but oh well. Okay, so I don't know what does the most damage to a 17 on that. 14, okay. So it looks like it's this guy, huh? 17, and then here comes the never-ending spree of hitting the numbers, huh? Let's see if I can make it so I... Okay, he decided to attack an Anki. That was not in his best move. All right, I want I want to I want to cut his hair. That's what I want to do. We're gonna see if we can actually get that done. I'm trying to do only the door here, so that way we don't, you know, destroy his base. That would be mean, and I want to do that. But the door should be good enough. And we'll see how it works. All right, Tara. Let's see if you're uh, if you're inside your base. Knock, 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 knock. All right, guys. So we are just about to get into Terrifier's base. We want to see if he's home, so we can get some haircuts going here. I'm tr I've been very careful. I've had to reposition like six times, fight off a few aloes. Yeah, it's been fun. It's been an interesting little little thing. I've kind of defended his base more than I've actually attacked it, which is kind of funny. Oh no, no, I'm still passive. No, no, come over here. There we go. Okay. And that is not the first time that that has happened to me when I've been doing this. And I've been trying to pull them away so they don't actually attack the base. And it seems to be doing okay. Because they're just playing ping pong with that saber too. So that's good. All right, cool. All right. So now we can get in. That's what, that's what's bit. It's kind of funny because I have been playing more defense than I have been offense. So. Terrifier. <laughs> He's not here either. This is so sad. He's not here. After all that hard work, he's not even there. I wanted to say hi, and he's not there to say hi to me. Oh well. Yup, it is very sneaky. That, that's it's very cheeky. Krabby's playing a smart game here of, you know, they're just letting themselves die so that way they don't have to worry about, oh, who's, who's this? This is always a clever trap. Well, that's the Tarasas gotcha. That is the design of a Captain Fat Dog who has some of the best trap designs I've ever seen. The man comes up with some stuff that is just incredible. <gasps> Kangaroo, that is that is cheeky. I want that. Okay, no. Stop, stop getting distracted, Teach. All right, we got to focus on getting us some griffins. Unfortunately, I don't see any griffins. Oh, there they are. Do they just spawn in because that would be beautiful if they're high level or at least higher than the ones I just saw? There's a Fiomia. All right. Let's see if I can get a hold of. There's a 55. Same ones as earlier. 50. 50 100. All right. So I want to try and tame that one in the upper right corner. They all look identical to each other. So that's kind of crappy that they all look the same because it's not like I can distinguish them based on that. But I should have everything I need trap-wise for it. All right, so one, two, and three. Just build the old school trap, and then one, 
two, and then you turn this guy on. Uh, where's disable? Um, wait, what? Switch to manual. Okay, close. And then auto close only. There we go. And then you open it right up. Nope. Open. There we go. Okay, cool. And then, yeah, that should be fine, actually. Now I've just got to aggro this one guy up here. Which, oh boy, which one was it? Um, is it that one? Nope. Is it that one? Yeah, it's, of course it's that one. Why wouldn't it be that one? The one that looks like it's going to be the hardest to gather, huh? There we go. There we go. Okay, so I've got him. I'm going to have to try and pull him up here. Without... There he goes. Okay, he's aggroed a little bit on something else. Excellent. That's what we needed. Really? You're going to aggro to me right now? Oh, come on. Okay, Kentros. Hmm. All right, buddy. Oh, he's pissed off the Kentros. Great. And he's level 100, so I don't think he's going to be high enough to survive this. But I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. I hope so. We'll see. Maybe I just do some exploring. I got the trap ready and everything, and I just need him to, you know, not get himself killed by Kentros. Okay. Yep, he's going to attack them. I'm going to have to wait till later in order to tame him, so that's good. Hmm. Spino. Should be able to get to it fast enough, though. Medium crop block. I swear, Ark is like the biggest troll game when it comes to actually getting good things. It's like, hey, you wanted something good? How about a medium crop plot? How's that sound? Cool, Ark. Thank you. I really wanted that medium crop plot. More than anything else, you caught me. All right, so now I just need to figure out if this guy has, oh, he has chilled. Excellent news, excellent. Oh, there's a car now, of course, it's a freaking, oh, whoa. Nope, he's not chilled. Is he just a griffin though? What level is he? Is that the 50? I don't even want the 50, like, uh, I'll come back later. Maybe later there will be something that I can actually use, because that's that's not even useful. I was thinking about it. Level 100 is still not that great. Like, I just I need higher than that. Hmm. Oh well. To it on, let's crank up your stamina a little bit here. Oh, terror birds and raptors. That's fun. Oh, that's the giant beaver nest? I think that is. That's going to be a minute, so I might as well wait for it. But at the same time, that's a giant beaver nest. Is there beavers? I don't see any beavers right now. Can I land on this thing? Oh. Oh, I can. Can I not? Can I not get in here? Oh, I can get in there. Ooh, that's dangerous. Uh-oh. 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 I'm gonna die. That's bad. That's quite unfortunate. Well, on a positive note, I got a bed. So... I didn't realize there were beavers there. I, I know I should have realized that. I figured they might be dead or something. But... Oh, my hair looks good. Mm. And put that fire out so that way it doesn't give away our position in here. We're going to go ahead and try and find our way down there. Without dying is the keyword. I wonder, you know, I think my pteranodon was on passive, so that's that's a very good thing. But, negative side of all, oh, there's the yellow drop. I don't know if I can make my way down there without a bird. Hmm. 
Okay. I might have to like jump into the water from over there. And I think that might be the only way to do it. Maybe. Okay. All right. So I hope the water's deep enough. I didn't think that, oh, Dionicus, lovely. And he sees me. And he sees me. I think I got him off the edge. Did I? Aha! Got him off the edge. Turd. Did you get for attacking me? Now I've got a swan dive off this cliff, hitting the water perfectly, which looks like the further I jump, the better off I am. So, a loss. Here we go. Uh oh. I don't think that's deep enough. It was. Aha! Success. And he's gonna fight them. Good news. T whistle. Come on. Come close enough so I can ride. Oh, this is the worst part. Nope. There we go. Perfect. Alright, now we get the yellow drop. We get the beaver dam. We empty it like a proper person. And we get a metal dino gate. What crappy loot. Uh, not shocked. Oh, wow. There's some more beavers in there, too. And they're fighting the Argentavis. Lovely. Hmm. All right. So we've got some more loot. We got some basic stuff. We did the little terrifier raid. Ooh, hello. What level are you? 140. Yes, please. I will take that. I'd be happy to tame that. Okay. That is excellent. I think we go on a taming spree, huh? Get some of these things that we've been working on. Oh, yeah, I should probably clothe myself again because it's helpful. Need that empty cryo. Where's my Rex? Ooh, I've got another empty cryo. Is my Rex in here? Yeah, my Rex is in there. Okay. All right. We don't want to risk losing this. This is kind of our only transportation as of right now. But we will, however. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to drop that because that's not useful to us anymore. These are, though, and so is this. Uh, so is that. And we've got pretty much everything we need in order to tame this bad boy. Ebola might be useful when he starts to run. I think I'm literally going to toss myself into one of these houses. Like, sprint. Full sprint into one of the houses. And uh, go from there. I think that's the plan here. Oh. That's, that's a hard night, friend. All right, so is that the 140? Where is this 140? She is around here somewhere. I just don't know where. Sheep, perfect. Don't need sheep need RG. Where did RG go? Hmm. It was around this spot. Huh. Pretty sure it was right around here. Pteranodon? Level is that pteranodon down there that's stuck perfectly? 130 male. Okay. But the 140 RG's better if I can find it. Is that Deinonychus again? I was over here, man. I swear it was. Do I need to go like came out over here? Where did it go? What is going on? Is that it down there? There's no way it made it all the way down there, right? It couldn't be it down there. That's it. 
Of course that's it. Why why are you all the way down there? I gotta like arc a shot down onto it. Too low? How am I not what? Alright, Deinonychus. Let's see if I can pull you off the edge as well. Yes, come over here. Right here, my friend. Now jump right off the edge, because I don't like you. I will raise one of you, but I will not like you. Don't think I'm going to be able to hit it from here. Ugh, it's like perfectly positioned down there, so I can't actually get to it. I think it's, oh, oh, I might be able to hit it from right up here. It's possible that this angle right here. Gotcha. What? Why are you running? Why are you running? I just shot you. Oh, it sees a body. I see. Okay. Oh no. Okay. Well, this is unfortunate. So now I think it dies. That Deinonychus is a good level Deinonychus. 130. And this Argentavis is gonna die. Oh my goodness. What unfortunate luck. Man. Sometimes Ark, you know? Sometimes Ark just arcs you. Oh well. I know there's some Pteranodons here somewhere. All right, I will look for something else then. There's a Kentro, Stego, Packy Rhino, Tur what? I guess I could use him, but not really super useful at this moment. All right, Galley, Raptor, I could, <laughs> Maybe I just use my bird and go find one. It seems to be better than whatever I'm stuck doing now. Where is my pteranodon? Okay. You're going to help me go hunt. Alright. And I don't see anything. I mean, there's the sheep, obviously. But I don't have access to get a sheep yet. Mostly due to my lack of uh, vegetable cake. That beaver dam is nice right there. Is that Argentavis still here? Or is he, uh, she, I should say. I think she is gone. She is no longer in the land of the living, you might say. Oh. However, this might be a freebie, freebie nest. Empty nest. Oh, that Stego just put that thing down. Level 25 Deinonychus egg. Thank you, Stego, for clearing that for me. I will see if I can grab this one. Not seeing any sneaking up on me. Level 85. This is like, you know, free tame, so I'm not going to complain about this stuff. Level 90. No need to complain about that. All right. Some more Deinonychus eggs. It's a great little startup. We got our basic resources. Still got to level up a little bit. Um, yeah, that's got to happen. Leveling's got to happen a little bit. Ooh, here's some RGs. Anything good? 20. I need some high level tames, and this is this is not high level. A Carno messing up two of them. A level I don't know. 15? Oh gross. That's not what I need. A Rex? 
Is that Rex? I think it's the same Rex. Level, yeah, it's a level 15 male Rex back there. Okay. I bet you I can mess that thing up, actually. A couple of good spins on it. I think it dies. 347? Yeah, 350. Yeah, that thing could die. 350. I mean, six attacks and we can kill this thing? Yeah, no problem. Come on, Tyranodon, you got this. You got this, I promise. That's what's up, buddy. There we go. Get those levels. Sometimes you just gotta play the uh, the waiting, waiting, you know, kill game, and it worked. Oh no, Raptor! Don't you knock me off my team. Okay. And I got an XP for that. Let's get my stamina up just a little more. Need some more levels in order to make a Argentavis saddle. I don't see anything useful. Is that is that the same Rex I just saw? Whoa, oh, 145 female Rex, but unfortunately for me, that doesn't actually mean much because I need a Bionic Rex, and that is not a Bionic Rex. This, however, could be useful. I don't see any of them? 130. Let's go. It's Deinonychus hunting for you. Sometimes you get lucky. Uh, okay, what level is that Pteranodon, huh? 85. Not high enough. Why can't I just get some good tames, game? Give me something. Castle's cool. I have to find a base location, too. We'll get there. We'll get there. Just takes time. I'll land for some stamina. Alright, this guy's got enough meat. He's feeding pretty well. And you just took a massive poop. Good for you. Good for you. Ooh, Argentavis. Is it a good one? Nope, it's about to die. Parasaur, literally the one 140 RG that I find is like getting smoked. So, that sucks. There were some RGs down in this corner. But they are... Ooh, they are there still. I don't see any beavers. What level are these? If they just smoked those things, level 95 and 85. Okay. If I was to land on this and hit it, do any beavers aggro? None. Alright, we're gonna try this then. Another beaver den run. I don't see any beavers. Nope, there's beavers. Thanks. That is my Pteranodon for you. Really strong on the defense. But, on a positive note, there's some more loot. I figured there might not be, but there 100% was beavers there. Oh, okay. Got the torches running now. Okay, cool. Well... I guess that's about all I can do. I just gotta get my stuff back now because I need to wait for like a dino respawn because I don't want to move too far from base having only literally one pteranodon. And then once I get that done and then it's just like finding a base is kind of like my next step, huh? I think that's what I gotta get, get moving on. Getting to a base. Oh boy, he's just chilling in the water. Lovely. I need my stuff back though, so. All right, love it. Okay, I'm gonna have to somehow aggro these two off a cliff by like, not necessarily sneaking past them, but getting, oh boy. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's that's it. See ya, buds. Oh, it is dark. I can't see a thing. That's the water I gotta hit. All right. Jump. Oh, did I go far enough? Oh, I did. Okay. I got that. Got the body back. Okay. Thank you. Oof, that could have been bad. I think I just saw something right there. Yep, there were Argentavis is literally on me. Oof. Close one. This totally looks natural that I did those torches like that. So that's cool. No one's going to know this is where I'm actually based up right now. They're going to see it and they're going to move right on past it and it's going to be perfect. I am not going to be a turd though. I am going to leave my body in the bed. So that way that uh, in case someone does want to lay claim to destroying me, they can. So anyways, hopefully that was fun for you. I mean, it was just a little bit of a entertainment thing. But uh, other than that, you know, I'm just chilling. Have a little bit of fun and uh if you want to check this series out please you know it's going to be a lot of fun check some of the other streams out see what they're doing and uh, other than that teach out